Hi guys. Sorry, I'm trying to eat, drive, and YouTube at the same time. I just wanted to come on really quickly and tell you guys. Uh, I wanted to apologize. A posting that I got, I did earlier about the food for less. Uh, one of my YouTubers did hit me up. Uh, I, I want to say her name is Milululu. I'm probably killing it too, so I do apologize. Uh, she did hit me up about it, but I did uh, run into the problem. Well, not the problem. I actually caught it uh, the third time I was doing it at this uh, uh, what's it called? At the Food for Less. Uh, it was I was looking for the specific hair color that I know my, mom, my mother in law would use. So I, the, I guess the Revlon. The butter, scotch butter, buttercream product, it's a different, it's not part of that one two ninety eight price, it's uh, five ninety eight. dollars actually, it's I think double the price, so that coupon actually reflects onto that actual product, so it's a coup, it's a product of Revlon, that's another, same name brand, but different entity type of thing, I don't know, I don't normally buy hair color myself very often, I think I bought it once, at Rite Aid, I think it was John Frieda, but, so, anyway, I didn't know really, really what I was talking about earlier today. I did buy a couple of them before I, I figured out that it is a different product of the, on the Revlon coupon that I mentioned, so, you know, it's not, I mean, if you guys already did it, then, you know, no biggie, but, you know, just don't continue doing it, just because you know, they're not going to get, the company's not going to get reimbursed for the coupon for the product and if they didn't even buy it, so we can't, we can't do it unless, I mean, if it's an er error on our part, like, I figured out that it was, then, you know, no harm, no foul, but you just can't continue doing it using all your coupons. It just wouldn't be right. Uh, but with that said, that actual product at CVS, at, I'm sorry, Walgreens. I did mention in another video out I heard wag on the wag, uh, Walgreens. I don't know if I posted it up yet, but they do have that buttermilk, butter silk. I want to say buttermilk, uh, but the buttercream. I'm sorry. See, I don't, I don't know, <laughs> but the buttercream Revlon. It's when you buy two, they're four forty nine each. You get two dollar two two thousand points. You use two of the three dollar coupons. You're pretty much paying ninety eight cents plus tax for two of them, which is the better deal to do. That way, people get reimbursed, and you know we're doing it, doing it the right way. So, I'm probably gonna go in and I'm gonna do go to I'm going to Walgreens. I'm gonna do the deal a couple of times and build up a couple of points and do it that way. It's pretty much just points that you're getting, you know, it's pretty much just building up, so anytime we buy stuff, it's there, you know, no worries. It's not like uh, Rite Aid where they they drop off after a certain amount of time. I don't think points for Walgreens ever expire, at least in this, it's like a year or something, maybe. Not quite sure on that. But I just wanted to come on really quickly and just talk to you guys about that really quickly. You could still, Food for Less, you could still do the $2 Clairol product for the Clairol Balsam, I want to say, or Balsami, something like that. It's the hair color uh, brand of Clairol that they have on sale for $1.98. They'll just, they, it's going to be, they will just have to, you just have to tell them that you've done the deal before and they just have to discount they just have to bring down the price of the coupon to the dollar ninety-eight, and they should be able to push it through. You know, I went to the store, and that's what this—that's what they happened with the with the Clairol. They pretty much ended up having to. Uh, I told them, you know, I beeped at the counter. She says it's not taking the product. I said, well, it's the product. It's just that it's over the amount of what the you guys are selling it for. So that's why they just had to mark it down and. They should ask the manager. The manager told her the same thing I told her, and it went through no problems. So I just wanted to just give you guys that footnote really quickly. 
I am having lunch, so I'm going to get back to eating, and uh, I'll talk with you guys later, alright? Have a good day. Bye.